Chapter 1, Mishnah 2. The Mishnah continues its discussion about the prohibition of doing malacha that requires great effort on Cholomoed, even to prevent a loss. Like the previous Mishnah, this one deals with Shemitah well, as well. We now turn to the words of the Mishnah. Rabbi Elazar ben Azari says, We may not dig a new irrigation canal, i.e. a ditch used to direct water through a field or from one field to another, during Cholomoed because it requires great effort, or during Shemitah, because such digging appears to be like hoeing, which is forbidden during Shemitah. The sages disagree with respect to Shemitah. However, the sages say we may dig a new irrigation canal during Shemitah. On Cholomoed, we may only repair damaged canals and not dig new ones. Another category of malacha allowed on Cholomoed is public needs. The Mishnah gives example of this kind of work. We may repair damaged cisterns, i.e. underground tanks used to collect rainwater for drinking, that are in the public domain, and we may clear them out by removing pebbles or dirt that have fallen into them, and we may repair the wide roads and the narrow streets and the mikvahs, and we attend to all other public needs as well, including digging new cisterns, if they will be needed by the public on Yom Tov. Another rule concerning work on Cholomoed is that even permitted work may not be scheduled for Cholomoed. The Mishnah states two exceptions to this rule. We may mark graves on Cholomoed to warn passersby of their presence, and agents of the court may even go out and, and in, go out to inspect fields for Kalayim on Cholomoed and uproot any that they find.